What's up, everybody? So here's another fun trick for y'all. Uh, yeah, so I ended up messing around with this soft lead. I flattened it. Um, but yeah, basically, I ended up flattening that song, and I lost the MIDI notes because it was MIDI, and now it's audio because I freeze and flattened. And now and I was like, crap. Well, I have to go back to a previous version where I did have the MIDI saved in the same project, but in a different version. I did like a save as. But then I was like, no, thank you, Ableton Live 10, because I walked over here and I look in the current project folder, and these are all the revisions that I have of this track. So now I can be like, oh, I'm in 1.3, that's the newest one, all that that we're looking at right now on my screen. But now I have a previous revision too. So I can open this up and be like, oh, super dope. There's my hip hop sub bass notes that I originally wanted, so I can drag that back over on a MIDI track, boom. Exactly what it was before it was completely freeze and flattened. So, never fear, if you need to go back to a previous project because there were MIDI notes and you ended up freeze and flattening or like exporting a stem or something or you wanted like a progression of eight bars for MIDI notes that you drew out, now you can go back into your projects and previous versions in the same project like I showed you with all the other samples and stuff in here that you can use.